everyone. So just a little bit of a disclaimer for the Alan Wake video. So for some reason, my camera just didn't work for that video. I, it was just because like the software just only picked up the audio instead of like the camera. Uh, my apologies for that one. So if you guys like, I mean, the content's still like, oh, chef's kiss, you know, but anyhow, uh, just want to let you know that if you're wondering like, why, why is his face like not in the video? Like it's always in the bottom of the corner, like right over here, you know, uh, it's my apologies. Um, uh, it just didn't want to fucking work for that video. So anyways, that concludes the disclaimer and to the video slash transition. What's going on everybody? This is the Triangle Button. Today we're going to be to playing a new game on the channel. It's going to be Ellen Wake, the remastered version for the PS5. I'm super excited to be playing this game. Uh, I don't know anything about it. I just know it's the same company that made Control. And for anybody that's subscribed now to the channel, you guys might have not seen like when I played Control. It wasn't exactly the best process. Like. I think I gave up like halfway during the game because of the difficulty of that game because it was like the checkpoints were awfully placed and then the enemies like were like overpowered in every sense. There is no difficulty, it's just you have to beat them, right? So anyway, I hope this game is good. I know a lot of people say that it's a classic and that you definitely should play it, especially because Alan Wake 2 is coming out in the fall. So yeah, I'm going to be checking this game out. Well, playing it right now, actually. So if you guys... Uh, want to like suggest like any other content on the channel just please leave a like comment and subscribe it not only helps me but it just shows me what you guys want to see right so if you guys want me to play you know a sports game or you want me to play like a new fps shooter just let me know and i'll play it for you guys anyways without further ado i hope you all have a great day and let's get to it And we're going to go on normal difficulty. I don't like taking the easy route unless it's an incredibly hard game that's Stephen infamous King or something. Once oh. wrote that nightmares exist outside of logic, and there's little fun to be had in explanations. They're antithetical to the poetry of fear. In a horror story, the victim keeps asking why, but there can be no explanation, and there shouldn't be one. The unanswered mystery is what stays with us the longest, and it's what we'll remember in the end. Hmm. My name is Alan Wake. I'm a writer. Badass intro, Alan Awake, I'm a writer. I've always had a vivid imagination, but this dream unsettled me. It was wild and dark and weird, even by my standards. So yes, it began with a dream. Following a typical nightmare pattern, I was late, desperately trying to reach my destination, a lighthouse. For some urgent reason, I couldn't remember. I'd been driving too fast down a coastal road to get there. I'd seen the hitchhiker too late. He was dead. Bro, I was convinced he didn't even touch his dead, neck, he touched his collarbone. Again. Suddenly, his body was gone. Episode one, Nightmare. I was in shock from the crash. I could hardly stand my feet. Reverse your controls? Hell no. You can change camera settings in the menu options screen. Okay, we can sprint. Nice. I had to go to the lighthouse. I knew there was something important waiting for me there. No, my car. I'm not even gonna look at him, we're just gonna run, it's fine. I'll make you suffer. 
Bro, no! Okay. Bro's not even close. You missed your deadline. With what? Damn. You can't stop me. What you gonna do, bitch? Hitchhiker was a character from the story I've been working on. Okay. How does it feel to die by the hands of your own creation? Seth seen worse. It's doing like a weak job. Is it gonna snap halfway? Play Stewart. Them like outside. Well, I know the wind blew it open or closed. Stop. I just need the dodge, my man. Anything I can allow me to get out. Follow the light. Yeah, see? You are hurt. You should go into the light. You are only safe there. Oh, this is neat. Ocean green, where waves are both wilder and more serene. To its ports I beam. To its ports I beam. Do you understand? No. Follow my light. Thank you, light. I just realized I probably blocked this web, like the camera. My bad. Okay. When it feels you coming, it will wake up. There's no time. I can only show you the most important thing. The hitchhiker has been taken away by darkness. You can't hurt him now. The darkness protects him from all harm. Only light can drive the darkness away and make him vulnerable again. Here, take the light. Pick up the flashlight. Okay, my bad. Turn your flashlight toward him and burn the darkness away. Give me a second, I gotta chase my light. You did it. Now the darkness no longer protects him, but it's still inside, controlling him. He can't be saved. He's still a threat. He is still your enemy. Here, take the gun. Me? Now you'll 
Yo, this is awesome. Okay. Good. You've done well. Remember what I've taught you. That is all. I will give you back your dream now. In the nightmare, a terrible darkness was taking over the world. The lighthouse was the last safe place on Earth. This is a neat book, man. that my back guys oh uh, I'll, I'll be honest I was kind of surprised that Come on, bitch. No, don't stop. Flare gun. Come here, bitch. Yeah, that's right. You're just a chicken shit now, huh? want a piece of me. Cardio. Run! Oh my god. Man's running like he's doing the five laps at a high school like track meet. Come on. Go! I need it! Run, 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 run! I don't know what that is! Give me the fucking hell dude. Oh I son of a bitch, he's tripping me. Go! Ah, uh, bitch, I got to the lighthouse. Oh, you're screwed now, bitch. Welcome to Bright Falls. Looks like a nice kind of homey town, you know? Oh yeah, fresh seafood.
I don't know why I clapped at that, but I just felt the need to. <laughs> All right, let me jump off. No, <laughs> Let's act like we're on vacation. Go stand next to that old gentleman there. Why is she? Why is she? <laughs> sure. What? I'll even give you a title for the shot. A city boy. Moments before he got eaten by a bear. Man, they should have done a remake. That'd be so cool. Hi. It just sounds like a looks like a cardboard like Hello you know there. facial. You a good time to visit our town. Deer Fest is just two weeks away. Where? Deer Fest, huh? Did you hear that, honey? You have. Just a couple more. If you don't mind me saying, I'm Pat Bain. Nice to meet you. Well, Pat Bain, I'm Alan. Look your eyes. I won't pretend I don't recognize a famous writer such as yourself, Mr. Wake. A pleasure. I'm an avid reader myself. I hope this isn't too presumptuous of me, but I'm the night host of the local radio station. Any chance I can get an interview? Look, Mr. Main, I'm on vacation. In fact. I'd appreciate it if we could keep my being here just between the two of us. I'm sure you understand. Fair enough. You can trust me to be. Oh yeah. Not a hard man to track down if you change your mind, though. I hope you two have a lovely holiday. Is this a good pose, honey? Very nice. I got a couple of. Yeah, me looking away, talking to the guy. Just settling in. Okay, Al. I'll call back later to make sure you're doing okay. And you call me if there's a problem, okay? Okay. Just looking out for you, buddy. Talk to you later. I love you too, Barry. You know he's going to be calling you every five minutes. Barry is Barry. I can always turn off the phone. You what can, is? can you? Text message from Barry. He says hi to you too. Is this my car? It better be my car, dude. Oh, don't tell me that's my car. Yeah, I'm a writer. <laughs> Established by the we car. We at the local diner to get the cabin key from the landlord. I'm Mr. Carl Stuckey. He's waiting for us. I'll go fill her up while you get the key. I'll pick you up here in, say, 15 minutes. Sure. Sure. I love you too. Go on. I'll promise to behave. What the hell are you gonna do? Rob the fucking diner? I've forgotten Come there on. are still places like this. Towns where everybody knew everybody. Welcome to the Oh Dear Diner. I, I was wondering if you could help me. I'm looking for... Mr. Wake. Alan Wake. Oh, God. I am your biggest fan. I know people say that all the time, but I really am. I'm glad to hear that. Rose. Rose, I'm looking for Mr. Stuckey. Carl Stuckey? Carl? Of course, Mr. Wake. He must have gone to visit the restroom. He'll be back in a moment. I can't believe it. I've got all of your books. Thank you? I got the cut up from the bookstore when they took it out of the window. The sudden stop. And to keep it here. Well, okay. Good for you. Uh, right. So much for a quiet vacation. Try the coffee. Just don't blame me when you fall in love, because it'll break your heart when you have Walking it. Walking around. Rusty here is no longer human. Nothing but black coffee under a thin layer of skin. Yeah, that makes two of us. Do me a favor, Sonny. I could really use a tune right now. Coconut, number six in the jukebox. I'd do it myself, but both of my legs have gone to sleep. <laughs> Circulation. What's the point of these coffee pharmacies? Is this person good? Don't go in there, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. I think I can handle it, ma'am. I didn't want to wait. I wanted to find Stucky to get the key and get out as soon as possible. 
The waitress was giving me a headache. Over eager Let me over. in. I had three Big Macs on the way here. <laughs> I need. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't. I can't right now. Alrighty. Here we go. Um. Oh, is this the bathroom? Oh, this was the male bathroom. Let me in. Hello? Mr. Stuckey? He's Stucky. In the bathroom. Carl couldn't make it. Unfortunately, he was taken dead. But I have the key for you and instructions on how to get to the lake. Okay. What the fuck is this? I wish you a good stay in my cabin. I'll come by later to check how you've settled in. And to meet your wife. I insist. I don't. Thanks. And meet your wife. Like, why you gotta like have this like dark shell and saying everything creepy and handing my cards in a weird way? Cauldron Lake, like a special place, very inspiring. You got lucky this time, young man. You can hurt yourself in the dark. Okay, ma'am. This really ought to be fixed, and then I must remind Sarah. Even that sounds better than your singing. Are you all right? <laughs> Splendid, splendid! <laughs> Damn hernia. It swells up like a boat. The Andersons, they're, uh, local musicians. We're waiting for Dr. Hartman to come pick them up. They wandered off from his... Bye, Mr. Wake. Wow, she came right on time. Mission accomplished. The key and the directions. My hero. I got some flashlights, just in case. Or shall we? Man was really under the weather. Can you believe this place? This would make a wonderful setting for a book. We're supposed to be on vacation, Alice. I'll figure it out when we get back home. Okay? Okay. We can talk about this later. I didn't want to talk about it. I wanted to bury my head in sand. Here's another one of my favorites to go with. Once upon a time, I was a successful writer, but that was a long time ago. I hadn't been able to write a word in two years, not since my last book. And now the weather. It's going to be a clear night, so you folks in the big city might want to look up every once in a while and see those stars winking down at you. It gets pretty dark out here, but they'll light your way. Diver's Isle? It's gorgeous, Alan. It's something, all right. Don't worry, honey. I'll get you inside safe and sound before it gets dark. And I've got the flashlight. I would hope so. It's a fucking Alice walk down the walkway. The fear of darkness. I wanted to make sure we were inside with the lights on before sunset. What's the fucking phobia called? I haven't heard of that one. She has a phobia of the darkness. What's it called? What's over here? Nothing I can inspect, I guess. What, what the heck did it let me? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. The island had once been the site for a love story. Maybe it would be that again. Okay. Here we go. Let's take a look inside. Hip hip hooray! Okay. The heck? Okay, the shadow just looked really weird. A shoebox filled with books by Thomas Zane sat on the shelf. I had never heard of him before. Hello? Anyone here? It's, uh, it's for you, so I hope not. It's kind of weird easier. Focus the light. 
What is up with these coffee thermoses? What can I do anything with them? I'm sure the other game will flip, like explain later on. For a moment, the oppressive feel of the nightmare I had seen on the ferry returned. Damn. She wasn't that scary looking. I needed to get the power running in the cabin. There had to be a fuse box or a generator somewhere on the island. The cabin looked like a time capsule from the 60s, or even earlier. Well, I would hope that this calendar right here would indicate what where it was probably from them just okay because that doesn't mean it was made in the 70s i know all right the power cable goes to that shed. i'm going honey <laughs> okay old generator had been connected to the power cable. I would not be comfortable with starting that generator. Shit. Hold on. I think I did pretty good. You heard the apartment, like look around the house, I guess. It was a beautiful place. I told myself I could rest here, sleep here, and forget about my work. Forget about it. You haven't written anything I in two years. Happy here. Wait, isn't the fear of darkness isophobia or something like that? Did I figure it out without even looking at it? I'm not even joking. Like I haven't like I just been playing the game. Hold on, I gotta look this up now. Isophobia. Oh, fear of daylight. Fuck. <laughs> well, I was close. I, I found the opposite, so just invert what that says. If you say it backwards, I'm sure that'll spill it. I both. Alice? Honey? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> the fuck? The old door had played a trick on me. Alice wouldn't have come out in the dark. Alice, I'm upstairs. I'm it's not that dark out, though. It's well, like sunset right now. I'm not the surprise. It's in the study. Go take a look. <laughs> okay. Surprise. Alice, what is this? I guess I was not professional. I thought maybe you could write here that a change of scenery would get you past. Damn, Alice, you. Everyone hey, keeps... hey, hey, just hear me out. There's a local doctor, Dr. Hartman. I read a book of his. He has a private clinic here. He specializes in helping artists. Maybe... So now you want to get me committed? No, it's not like that. That's not... You haven't written in years, Alan. Alan? Alan? I don't, just don't. I don't want to hear it. God damn it, Alice. This is extreme. God Holy... I knew she wouldn't follow me in the dark. <laughs> I need some time alone to use the phobia against her. It's kind of cruel, my man. And you're freaking out over it like, God damn it. You want me to write a book that was my passionate career? Damn you. The guy needs to chill, man. All the lights were out. I'm coming. I'm coming. Woo! It's all right. I'm coming. No, 
What the hell? Fuck. Oh no. Dive. What an expert dive, my man. Perfect entry. Hit the point. 100 or was it 90 degree angle to the water? Why are we in an accident? Waking up in the crashed car felt like I had woken from one nightmare and entered another. I couldn't remember how I got there. All I knew was that something terrible had happened to Alice. The phone was dead. I'd have to find help on foot. Okay. Among Alice's things was a book, a the creator's Vegas drama, book. by a Dr. Emil Hartman. Seeing the book brought back my fight with Alice. I didn't like it, and I didn't like the guy's well, smug buddy, face. Well, buddy, you were kind of an her. asshole to her. You went outside purposely to get away from her. The gas and, station was my okay. best bet. They'd have a phone I could yeah, use. Yeah. It looked like a long hike through the forest to get there. But it's the fact that like he argued with her and then used her phobia as a like in a menacing way like that's kind of fucked up oh and i got no laugh flashlights nor flare gun all the light in the world has gone hello oh this is a good guy unless it's a car coming down <laughs> Hello? Someone there? Page one. How to be a better husband. The loose sheets of paper were pages from a manuscript entitled Departure. That was the name I planned to use for the next novel I had never gotten started. I was named the author. I hadn't written it. I couldn't remember writing it. In the scene on the page, the hero was attacked by an axe murderer in the woods at night. Coincidence? I think not. Alright, yeah, you found the manuscript page. Yeah, it's just so it's basically detailing the story, and now we're in the game game. Okay, cool. Anybody there? Please, I've been in an accident. The lights up ahead were a good sign. Maybe I wouldn't have to hike all the way down to the gas station to find a phone. Cool. All right, we got it. Um, anything in the scene though? Nothing really. Can I climb this? Yeah. The jumping's a little wonky in this game, if I'm being honest though. I wish it was a bit better. Lose the deposit. Cabins for rent in. Oh hell, Carl Stucky. Pleased to meet you. Non-representing reservation deposit required. Fair and square. Okay. Is this meant to be a scary game? Sorry. Come on, bitch. Let's roll. Let's go. It's pretty shitty. Hey, 
Hey man, if you made a reservation, you put a deposit down. Any second now, and Stucky would be knocking on the door with his axe like Nicholson in The Shining. During your trying, it's the latest thing in Tester Blade. 911, what's your emergency? Right Hello? Hello? What the fuck is he to no fucking way? Get the fuck out of here! Come on, run! Oh, come on, you're an asshole! No! Oh shit, run! Run! Okay. This guy is not very nice. Like, I get it. I didn't leave a deposit. No way, dude. Outside the shooting range, and now I just killed someone or something. You didn't kill no one, no yeah. They just disappeared. If I was dreaming, it felt real enough to make me sick. The most quietest, like, kick of the generator. The dark forest was the last place I wanted to go, but I had no choice. I had to get to the gas station. Okay, so it could just turn that on like whenever. But why does it go left? Oh. Yeah, take it easy, buddy. Eerie hand painted graffiti was revealed by my flashlight. Someone had hidden a chest of supplies near it. No way. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're ready now, boys. You want a piece of me? Duck season, bitch! Yeah, I watched Looney Tunes. <laughs> okay. All right. Who's up here? Okay. What happens if I, like, run into the... Oh! Oh! Shit! Whoops, my bad. Alright, let's take a look at this manuscript. Well, I can't really read it, because now I'm like going to be like halfway in the novel, but it's fine. Okay. Rose knew she had been gushing, but right now, she didn't care. As far as she was concerned, her brief meeting with Alan Wake was literally the high point of her life. She watched as he got in the car with his wife. She was pretty, confident, at ease with Wake. Not like Rose. They were perfect for each other. She had given anything to be called their friend. Yo, okay. Pretty neat. What the hell was that? Mm -hmm. Assume it's nothing, buddy. When I saw the river below, something uncoiled itself inside my head. I saw the river below, and something uncoiled in my head. Falls in the river. Yeah. 
You're fine, dude. I'll be honest, this isn't a really scary game. What the hell was that? Let's assume it's nothing. When I saw the river below, yeah. something oh, yeah. self in my head. inside my head. I realized that I'd have to find a way across. I didn't even want to look at the water. I did. It's fine. No worries, buddy. Ah. Oh, what if there was a manuscript page back there? Hold on. Oh, is there like multiple ways to get by this thing? Coffee thermos. Gimme, give gimme. Give okay. See, I don't even know what these coffee thermoses do though. Like, does it give... I wish it gave me more energy. It doesn't feel like it in this game. Man, like, runs out of energy super quick. Stucky was still out there, in the dark, stalking. for the uh, aim. Sorry, I'm throwing kind of a weird thing there. Okay. <clears throat> now, I know there's something back here. The Taken are filled with darkness. Taken. They're Taken. Okay. Hey, yo. Now, this is what I'm talking about. Don't act like that hurt. It's okay. I'll just chill in the light. I'm like Superman. I bathe in the sun. Oh my god. The guy's like making it look like he's fucking like full, like has no stamina. I had to make my way up some other way. Guy can't run, man. Like, it's just general it should be kicking. This is why you got to make sure you always going for a run every now and then. You know, like... 42 rounds. Whoa! I'm cooking. All right. no power. There was bound to be a generator somewhere at the logging site. Sure, let's try and climb this thing. There we go. Do we good? With all this forestry equipment around, there had to be yeah, something Yeah, I use see to it. Chill. Time. Just don't die. Hmm. <clears throat> Expect a Patrona! Oh shit! Oh no! Fuck this, man. Pretty good. Pretty good. 
Good. Gotta get the manuscript. No way. Okay. Alright, looking pretty good. Come here, bitch. I got a flashlight and a two shells for a shotgun. I'm ready. So I guess I didn't need to go up there. Oh my god, dude, are you going? Are you gonna have a heart attack on me? Holy shit, guy can't jog. He's struggling. I was gonna say, if I fucking drop there, I'd be so mad. That's five. Okay. Alrighty. Are we almost there? Holy shit, how far is the station? The gas station was closer now. It's light welcoming in the darkness. <laughs> I fear none. Listen here, pal. I don't wanna, you know, flex too hard. Okay, where the hell is he? That hurts. Guy threw a fucking like hatchet at my back. What an asshole. He's new to the town. Guy's throwing shit at me. Come on. Yeah, uh, you throw your hatchet and run away now, huh? Listen. Everybody thinks they're so tough till I come around. How the hell did I get past here? Game's kind of easy, but I just don't know where to exactly go. Like, this feels like I'm going the right way, but it doesn't. Oh, this should be the right way. Seems to be a generator here. Okay. No judgment. I mean, it's not really great for your heart, though. We're being totally truthfully or truthful here. I do just kind of have to give me a second not fair let's be fair here
Listen, man, I'm just trying to get to the gas station before the end of this episode. Oh, shit! Oh, you guys are cheaters! No, no, no! I mean, I don't see why not. Like, I get, like, you know. I mean, I wish I had more. That's like, you know, for sure. But, oh, here we go, finally. Oh. I recognized the parade float I had seen in Bright Falls when I first arrived with Alice. Man hasn't tracked for this After much the since college. I just experienced in the darkness, the lights of the gas station felt comforting. At least for a moment, the same world reasserted itself. Give me that manuscript. I gotta use this for my next book idea. The garage was a mess. It looked like someone had trashed the place, or that there'd been some kind of fight. Uh, games and activity, or activities, raffle tickets, deer fest parade. Okay. Please just use the phone. Put you on speaker. Hi. Finally, just trying to get somewhere. I was in a car crash. My wife, Alice, she's missing. Calm down. We were staying in a cabin on the island, on Cauldron Lake. There's no island on Cauldron Lake. Not since the big eruption in the 70s. Please. Like the calendar. There, okay? You look like you've taken a pretty bad knock to the head. Are you okay? Listen. We'll figure this out. Please get in the car. We'll swing by the lake and then we'll go to the station. Okay? Mr. Wake, have you seen Stucky, the guy who owns this place? I realized I couldn't tell her what had happened in the forest. She wouldn't have believed me. And then she wouldn't have helped me with Alice. Don't you like break and you fall down? End of episode away! Go to sleep. 
Let's go! Okay. Previously no! Alan Wake. Okay, we already know what happens there. Oh, three years ago. Okay, hold on. Can I, like... I don't want to, like... Okay, we'll start the first cutscene for this, okay? Three years ago in New York, okay? Matt's clean shaven. Okay. See? Groceries. Because selling books. Honey, I'm home. Okay. Back here, sweetie. Alright, so. How was it? Okay, we're gonna pause the episode right there. If you guys like the content that you're seeing and want to see more of it or show your love for the channel, just leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Other than that, I hope you all have a great day and I'll catch you on the next one. See you later and bye bye.